a welcome back to another Elden Ring video. As discussed earlier, I felt like continuing this. I will not just do random footage of me going around <laughs> the world. But just, I will make walkthroughs of uh, key places like, for example, I did Stormville Castle. And next up the list is uh, Morn Castle. Castle Morn. Uh, as you can see, I did this a bit. I just wanted to progress a bit so that later on I can showcase the academy and then afterwards the dam and then and etc. Uh, so yeah, this game is so nice, I'll play it twice. I mean, maybe even more because uh, I've also been enjoying PvP and co-op as well. Just, you know, putting my sign next to the boss and then helping other people progressing. Okay, so with Castle Morn, I think it's the best to start from this point because you'll have to cross the Bridge of Sacrifice for that. And eventually when you approach it, you will see something else is also happening, so... But by itself, I think Castle Morn is not that uh, big itself, but it, um, it has a quest line as well, which I will show what to do, but I will not spoil the um, text so much, I'll just skip through it. Alright, so I don't think this is the best way to approach this. Uh, well, you know, now that I think about this, it, this might be the only way to approach it. You know, I think sometimes uh, riding on horse and, fuck off, and attacking is a bit counterintuitive because you have to right click to attack to the left, and sometimes I mess that up. So here is a heavy guarded bridge. Uh, with a ballista, so you have to be very careful. I have never discovered another way in, so you just have to kind of muster yourself through it. Or you can just use torrent to just dash through it, because I do not see any other way in. Nah, not through there. <laughs> Hell nah. And also I will be showcasing uh, the Hand of Milan Melania. I always say uh, Melania for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> because that's a normal human name, you know, Melania, Trump, you know, but <laughs> this is Malania. Anyway, uh, I will be showcasing this. I have a feeling the bleed effect doesn't do so well when you do its special attack, because I have a feeling that uh, Rivers of Blood, the uh, weapon I used before, does do much more damage and blood damage as well, uh, and the bleed effect, I mean. Uh, but this one has just a, such a cool attack, so... Why not? Ah yeah, I like stones. Getting stuck on stones. Oh, if you're curious about my status... So this is my status, my damage. I don't know why that suddenly changed, but well, whatever. Uh... Yeah, dexterity is like 73. And arcane, because arcane is needed for Hand of Melania. Uh, but, you know, luckily, um, my other weapon only scales with dexterity, so. I just put my uh, points in dexterity and arcane so I can wield Hand of Melania. And the other one, let me see. Rivers of Blood also just skills the best with uh, uh, Dexterity and also a bit with Arcane, that's also uh, true, so no uh, strength or uh, intelligence needed, so this is not an intelligence build. Yeah, I forgot about that one. This is not an intelligence build, so yeah, he will um, do that. It's not such a punishing thing, because uh, normally when they are actual Ballistas, uh, you get a problem that they snipe you from afar and it goes fast and deadly. So what I suggest is... Don't you dare jump. What I suggest is to just go through torrent with this until you get here. You know, there's also a thing I sometimes don't understand. It just so suddenly switched to uh, one blade two-handed. I don't know why it does that. Well, that's life. So once you have pressed uh, Torrent to the end, just kill them off, or just don't kill them. Just continue to rush with Torrent through it, and here to the right you have a uh, Sight of Grace. Please grace me. There. 
All right. I do think uh, ha Hand of Malenia does scale well with this one. Because uh, it is, as far as I'm concerned, a successive attack. Uh, you have, of course, the first uh, slashes. And then after the other slashes, it might do more damage. I don't know. But I have a feeling that it does, because it's successful. <laughs> Here's a quest line. Oh, wait, you! I, no, wait. My good father Hold on. Himself. That's I strange. Okay, no spoilers, but I think... Then please. Mm -hmm. to my yeah, no, no, it's not the same. He can be but she does look he like another stubborn. NPC quest. That gets you, like, the bad ending. Because also, she has also blindfolded, but uh, more I don't think we should say. Because that will be spoilers. You know what? This place is particularly not so interesting. It has a giant. It has some uh, dudes, some uh, what is it? soldiers, a dog, die dog, and then you have these things. I find I hate them so much. I hate them. They're so ugly, disgusting. <laughs> I suppose monsters in this game should not be princes and princesses. Fair enough. So I guess the design. Is well enough to for me to loathe it, but still I hate their faces. Okay, so here's another side of grace. I'll just you can rest here, whatever you want. That's a ball. I they are demi humans. Yeah, those ugly things. Huh. No, no, I didn't know you sold, sold those things. But well, whatever, it's not like I really need anything from here. Be well. Be well, at least. Okay, so you see this, and after this it's gonna be a bit tricky, especially because if you're the first playthrough. You'll see why. <laughs> Let's go. I'm not so... I'm not so worried about that uh, dude anymore, but you'll see what's gonna happen soon. Woo. Sniper here. You'll see him in the distance now. Just take the cover behind those things and you'll be fine. It's a bit slow, so... Those things don't do too much damage to me anymore, so I'm not that afraid. And once you're at his feet, you don't need to worry about him. Because as you can see, he doesn't really... He will still try to hit you, but he can't hit you if you're at his feet. Uh, if he's still using the bow and arrow. I, wait, 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 wait. I think there's another um, side of grace besides here. On the right side, as far as uh, I can remember. Maybe not, I don't know. It's the beach. Uh, I suppose not. Should check this beach out. Uh, beach out in my spare time. I don't think I've really discovered it fully yet. I can vaguely remember there being a side of grace somewhere here in the beginning. Maybe inside, maybe. Yeah, it's probably inside. Just. Look around. Yeah, yeah, you know, I don't remember. Something died and gave me some stuff. I don't remember, yeah, it's just inside the side of the place. Nothing died. What is dying? So it's so weird. Sometimes you just get random things. Okay, let's go inside. I think the side of the place is there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's here. My flasks are at the max. Uh, was there something of importance here? No, doesn't look like it. No secret I had. Thank you. Comment.
The only thing I find really annoying is to cycle through this. Because you, the, originally they want you to use the arrow keys, which is very weird. Especially when you're in a fight, because then you have to either get your movement hand to the arrow keys or your uh, fighting hand to the arrow keys. So I did it with scrolling, but even then sometimes with scrolling, uh, while you're fighting you get panics and then you sometimes don't get on like the flask and then you die <laughs> because you want to have a specific flask like health problem most of the time uh, if you don't want to fight these dudes you can just go around here you'll have some dogs but that's that you can pick that up if you want but there are dogs there I hate dogs there's some dogs here if you don't want to fight those I find them rather annoying. Dogs too, but there are three there. Are like eight of them there. If a pumpkin had that, so you have a choice now, technically speaking. Uh, you can get up all the way over there, where my head just points up a bit over. But you have to go. Oh, you know what? Because that way is. Well, in the end, you end up at the same, but you do have the pumpkin head there. If you don't want to fight that, then what you can do is pick this up. No, just kidding. Sneak. It's like this character immediately has sneak 100 <laughs> from the beginning. Go past here. He might notice you, but... As long as you just keep sneaking. It's better to fight one if he goes after you than fight them all. It doesn't seem that he really noticed me. And here's a chest here. Yeah. I think this is the better way to go than past that uh, uh, pumpkin hat. But then again, you'll end up at the same place anyway. Here they are slaughtering us. It's some sort of revolt going on by the demon demons here. Better take them out because they will go after you once they have slain that dude. What's going on? <laughs> okay, here you can sometimes try to just sneak past it. Let them fight among themselves. Uh, yeah, okay. You know what? Let's go here. It doesn't really matter for me. It's not like there are any really important items here. Get a torch, it's not so important. Okay, you don't even have to sneak past. I feel on the torch, sneak past them, but you, what you can do is just you can go across here and to this ladder. So if you go just right past the pumpkin head, you'll end up down here. Oh, wait. So if you go past the pumpkin head, just immediately to the right, you'll end up here and you can access this place from that ladder. So. Bastards. Just stay under them, I think. It's the best. Sooner or later they'll descend, but they can't snipe you from afar. Alright. Big ass feathers. So you can go here, but there uh, is just an item at the end. I think you should be careful here. Oh, yeah, 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 wait, wait, I'll show you. There is this dude behind those uh, barrels. Do you see those barrels? There's a dude there, see? He will immediately jump you once you 
come closer. Okay, so it contains the smithing stone. Yeah. At this point for me, it's, I don't need smithing stones anymore. I have plenty. So one important thing to do besides going to the boss is... Uh, the NPC that they met all the way in the beginning has a letter which you have to give to um, this is dude further up here. There's the here's the letter. There will be no. There's no fighting anymore. No surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> I remember there used to be fighting here, I don't know why. <clears throat> okay, there you have here a dude. Ah, uh, there's a face on Edgar that you can see. Menial, they gave me cloud, cream sorrow, whatever. Take this. Uh, this kid, but I can't even if the cat. To ensure that. If you have a father. Okay, so you'll stay you here until you defeat the boss. And then you have to return. There's nothing up there, uh, past there, so you just turn. Okay, so when I first was playing this uh, place, I got stuck because, you know, it's not obvious you what you'd have to do now. Because if you go around, you'll not find a way forward. No, I don't like when sometimes when the game just makes you have to drop to a place where, where it's not so obvious. Okay, so here is a lost race. If you just go down, down. It's not the worst here because I eventually found it on myself. If you fall down here, there are some slugs, I think, down there. So. If you don't want to fall down there, you just have to run and jump correctly. But then again, if you fall down here, there are also some other things in here. Let me see what they were. But they... It doesn't seem that they really notice you. There's a slug there. Whatever it is. Basically, you can ignore them. It's not like a big deal. There's nothing down there, that's for sure. Unless there's something down here. No, okay. There are some of those like thingies there. Nothing of the bottom. Not a slug. They're too slow anyway. He's a more happy dude. Can give you trouble if uh, because it's a small place. I have noticed that um, if you are narrowed down, it's much more difficult. Like dragons, like there is this. Uh, if you fight a dragon in the open, it's not as difficult as if you fight a dragon in uh, a, a narrow a narrow space. So there's the uh, talisman, very important. There's one dragon in uh how is it called uh i don't know uh something like a dragon barrel place it's on it's on a bridge and that is way harder but then also it wasn't so obvious for me you have to go down here i don't like when you have to kind of like guess where you have to go and it's not that obvious because you just have to go jump down from somewhere all things considered this isn't the biggest place to uh, conquer like the academy itself is much bigger if you go down this hole Be very careful.
I think there are rats down here. I hate rats. The best thing of rats, or well, the best thing to do with rats is just to fight them in the open and in the open space as well. If they start sing, uh, singling, or well, surrounding you, then um, it's difficult to get a hit in because they do stagger you if you are not heavy arms with, I don't know, with a lot of boys. And there's, uh, yeah, there's a side of grace here. This is, I think, the last side of grace before the fight. So, you'll have this place here. Technically speaking, you can just go fall down here. At least that's what I did, but... Because then you don't have to go past these dudes here, which I didn't like. But there is a... Technically speaking, you have to go down here. <laughs> but, but, you know, if you're on the bridge, you can just fall down. So. Okay, now we fight. If this weapon is the best for this boss, it's a. You know what? This weapon doesn't always. Uh, okay, you know what? It's time for me to go to this place. Because as you can see, if you want to do the attack... They can easily stagger you. But then again, if it works, there you go. <laughs> like the complete... Uh, uh, the complete attack almost killed him in one go, so... That's nice. So yeah, there's another side of grace. Now you finish this. Do I have already enough to uh, level up? Probably not. No. Okay, now we have to go. Let me see. Behind the castle. That is. You have to go back to this dude, but you have to go past through the whole. Courtyard again, because he this is down where you can't reach this dude anymore. So, fortunately, to go through the whole courtyard again. Can I, I guess I'll now I can show you, uh, you know, the way past the country. See how my messages are doing. Found fifty-seven. So that's my biggest one. <laughs> oh, let's remove some. Don't do so well. You know, what I also find interesting is that the Malenia attack that I just did, in PvP, they can quite easily dodge that. Much better than when Melania does it to you. You know. Yeah, just get up. By the time you get up, you're dead. I have no clue what to do with Sanction Ashtons. I don't know what they actually do. Okay, then there's this dude here. Hmm. 
damage the pumpkin head there as well. Just uh, pumpkin head doesn't work with what I have. I need to be able to roll properly. But then again, I haven't found uh, better equipment than a oh, whoopsie. And scaled arm. I mean, there are better ones, but they have uh, so much heavier. I think scaled armor is one of the best armors to have uh, with um, a dexterity kind of build instead of, you know, uh, strength or, you know, fortified. So, of course, the omen armor, Linus armor are much uh, better. But if you don't have a lot of stamina, they will have you will have heavy loads and um, that is not good for rolling. So yeah, I think the scaled armor is one of the best. Like these ones are all lower, so you don't have to. The only thing that you have to look at is these couple. I have noticed that technically speaking, I can switch to these ones because it doesn't bring my equipment to a heavy load. Technically speaking, you can do this. But honestly, yeah, I find the aesthetics not so beautiful. I'm fine with just wearing uh, skilled armor. It looks more clean. <laughs> and that's for sure. I think you can even get Yeah, and also just do his big this and just fall down here, it doesn't really matter. I knew it, see? There, were f there was fighting here. Well, I know that I will not... I just have to rush through it, I suppose. They'll just mind their own business for the time being. Yeah. Now you can talk to him. I'm in your thought keeping this one no longer than sight. Rest. And devote Marina as I only hope. And devote Marina as I only hope. Okay. You do have to ch always exhaust the. Uh, uh, no, wait, that's the wrong one. You have to go here. Uh, you have to uh, exhaust the dialogue to make sure that uh, if you don't exhaust the dialogue, sometimes they just stay that place and you have to exhaust the dialogue before they move somewhere else or before it continues the quest line. F in the chat. F Queen in the chat. How could this be? My daughter is a fault life. I choke and oh. the foul I'll hunt the rest is sure. Oh. The foul I'll hunt the rest is sure. Okay. Oh. The foul I'll hunt the rest is sure. So it's not finished yet, she's dead, but his quest line is not finished yet. Uh you know what, I'll go quickly to the here is the where he will reappear. I haven't been there yet. As I did it on purpose, I haven't been there yet, but he will reappear there. I really defeat this dude here, the uh, tree avatar. There's a reason why it's called Revenge Shack, by the way. <laughs> I don't want you to interfere with my thing here. <laughs> As you can see, I've been forced off my horse. That uh, means one reason and one reason only. Been invaded. So that is the dude that uh, was in. Yeah. 
Jeez. <laughs> Truth be told, this this weapon and got the revenge and died. So yeah, that was uh, him. That was mourning over. It was his daughter Irina. It was his daughter because she was slain, and he found the people that slain her and killed them all. And get this thing out of it. I don't know what to do with it. I never did something to do it. Uh, truth be told, I never really did a lot of item crafting because I usually don't really do it. Hmm. That would be cool if they had. Wait. Poison, poison. If you could throw a rot at people, I think. So. You know. Ooh. Well, anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, that was Castle Mon and its quest line. I hope you enjoyed it as well, and I'll see you in the next episode. Cheers.